Happy day one of coming alive at Christmas or my Christmas, yes, is actually the name of the study. I forgot the own name of my study. Anyways, I'm sitting in front of my Christmas tree. If you looked below, you'd see all the needles that have fallen. It's fake. I don't know why the needles are falling, but anyways, it's day one, and today we're just talking about our surrendered Christmas yes. Placing our surrendered yes, our expectations, our schedules, our ideas of what Christmas should look like. Uh, because it's easy to build these expectations around comparisons around what everybody else's Christmas looks like or what we think this holiday season should be. And I just want to encourage you to begin this study with offering your Christmas yes of surrender, placing your yes before the Lord, just like Mary did. Listen, if I was Mary and an angel came to me and told me I was going to be the mother of the Son of God, I would have some questions, some insecurities, some thoughts of maybe you meant to get my neighbor upstairs. Like, I really do have a neighbor that lives upstairs. Like, I live in a quadruplex. I don't know why I showed you the ceiling. There's the a lovely view. Anyways, I would think maybe I would say, you got the wrong girl. But Mary said in Luke chapter 1, verse 38, I am the Lord's servant, said Mary, may it be done according to your word. So I just want to encourage us together to say that to the Lord this Christmas season. I, here I am. I'm your servant. Let it be according to your word. I'm giving you my Christmas yes. I'm praying for you and for us as we give our Christmas yes together for these next 25 days. Also, do you like some of my crazy ornaments? I think that's like a weird owl. Maybe the weird owl and the crazy reindeer on there. And you and I, we can say our Christmas yes together.